Hi, this is just a little report. In case everyone, you know, like every so often I do a bit of serious stuff. This is one of those many. Here I am at a station, commonly known as by a regular station that people use. You know, it's run by various outlets overground, as well as the rail. Now what they seem to be doing these days in, it seems to be the latest trend within the transport system. Now I'm a bus driver, yes, we also got similar trends. Now in particular, many stations, this one in particular, has started doing one thing which is most common. Now it started with the underground, the underground started it first. And they started with the fact that certain times of the day, certain times of the night, you could only go in one and out another. Well now, British Rail have said, ah, oh, that's a very good idea. And they say it's a good idea. And I've got to be honest, in all fairness, to a degree, rush hour, yes, it's a perfect idea. But some stations have one issue where there's not enough staff manning them stations and it only takes a disabled person to either be short, uh, partially sighted or somebody who can't hear or both which is a common thing as well and now they won't realize the criteria of the way a station is being run these days or the way they want to run them now there's nothing in all fairness, there isn't nothing wrong with that. I mean, you've got here, like, this is how the planning is on one of the stations that I'm at. You've got lovely stairs. This way, the stair that's open to the midst of society, this is where they want people to go up. So they want everyone to go up one way. As I said, in principle, yes, rush hour, perfect. It works, but, and obviously a manned, a fully manned station, it also works as well. But in some stations, alas, that isn't the case. And here we are at this particular station. I'm not at liberty to uh, disclose because I've not had permission to do so. But I don't mean that bad to the company that are running the particular station. But yeah, you've got those stairs there that you just saw a minute ago and you've got this thing here see that that there is a lift so that covers that but this is not just through rush hour the principle they're sinking with these railway stations are there's no longer you've got no longer to think about which way you're coming in, which way you're going out. Have you got a valid pass? Have you not got a valid pass? Hopefully you've got a valid pass because, you know, everyone pays normally. Other than certain stations which do not have gates. But that's irrelevant. This is not what we're talking about today. The thing we're talking about in particular. Now, right at the far end of this platform is the way a person must come down well no go up to where their where their station ticket office is but during every day of the hour and probably rush hour at the moment it's rush hour but now this point here see that no exit you've got it on one two you got it on one i don't know can anyone see that you got it on one. Obviously, this one. And that one. These are, the, these are the things that you've got. These are the exits that you must go, come down on. You can't go up during rush hour. Which, in principle, ain't practical. But it is practical during rush hour. So one asks, now, should they not revise the way and the principle they're doing that? Now, the principle that I'm approaching is the fact that, yes, it works, it's a good idea, 
but it's not the perfect idea. But there's the overcrowding on stations, which is the most common problem of today's route. Now I'm walking up the no exit exit, which, you know, it's not rush hour now, but in principle, I'm not supposed to be doing this. You know, all right, I don't get fined for it, but it's the point. This is how a station needs to be run or this is how the principal of the station wants to be run. So one asks the question, now, is that really truthfully in that level a practical when you saw how far the other, st the other part of the station was, but you have to walk all from the other end up to this point? Oh. And then finally to where the gates are and I can see people see that even buggies have the same problem that is where that is where the gates are so your take on that would be useful and but I don't know why but that is the principle of things no your coat's in the back here. you sure yes so anyway sorry about the interruption and that is the way um, certain railway stations want to run things. And I want to share that with everybody because sometimes in a good idea it works, in other occasions it's not that practical. And in this particular area, it's a very busy station. In spite of a small subsidiary station, it is a very, very busy station. Anyway. This is my Mitchell saying on a report